Hi, um, I'm JD and I've had more than one person that's turned around and said, what do you do with your spare time? So I thought to myself, you know what, with the amount of people that have asked me, I thought I'd just show them, it makes it easier. So uh, I'm known for being highly geeky and a little bit twisted, so no more. Um, but yeah, everybody's been after trying to see what I have in my said geek rooms. So I thought um, 101 of this is four years worth of collecting and it's my little geek cave. Uh, thankfully, I have a very understanding other half. Ah, it's to be left at. So yeah, just to start it off, we've got, as you can see, geekiness. But yeah, so... I thought I'd uh, show the room and what it's all about. As I say, if there's anything in here that you've been trying to look for and you can't find, please get in contact because I may have some links or uh, some people that may be able to assist. I do like collecting Lego on a regular basis. But uh, yeah, as you can see by the collections, there's quite a few there that they just don't seem to get made although they are so cool that's all i say to that but yeah i've uh i've got lego hanging out from everywhere it's quite weird but it's uh, all mainly marvel and dc there's no extras to that arkham asylum set absolutely brilliant quite rare to get hold of nowadays especially if you find yourself an original one Obviously, there's the Joker's Fun Ground. Also, yet again, quite cool. Has to be said. Definitely has to be said. This is the one that people have been asking about at the present second because um, I've had this just wasting away in a corner. Uh, it's a beautiful piece. It's the Heli Carrier. Um, this is the second one of mine. I'm keeping one boxed. Keeping it for that miraculous day that it turns into something much bigger um but yeah the stand that comes standard with it is this one uh which is cool has to be said still obviously keep it as it is but this one i find displays it so much better uh this stand was 26 quid and i don't think uh i'd have it any other way now it's just absolutely beautiful really truly is uh shows the shows it off in perfect light still waiting to do electrics on that oh when i get to it i will but uh yeah there's lots and lots of different things here all just building up over a piece of time yeah no that's not john snores but um yeah as you can see there's i'm big into my signings Always big into my signings. Obviously a huge Batman fan. That was one of my my loves. Blessed Bob Kane. You gotta love Bob Kane. Who doesn't like a bit of Bob Kane? Nah, unless in case you're more into Stan Lee, but that's part and parcel. And then you've got young man there that was made. That's Pepper Cura. Like doing cosplay and uh working it through. Normally seen at MCM. LFCC occasionally if you're into that. Bonus point if you can see Ant Man. <laughs> Quite easy to find. So yeah, that's uh that's the room in its entirety. Lots and lots of books. Yet yeah, again, if this starts taking off, I'll uh I'll start doing reviews on some of those Blackest Night, Marvel Zombies. He's only just a start off lot. It's uh have been running for quite some time now but i have a large large ish collection as i said i have an understanding other half so she knows why i am she knows what i'm doing type thing um keeps me in the cave but also keeps me amused in the cave um if you like this uh, and you want a link for said stand because it is really cool if you own a heli carrier that is definitely a one to go for um please just leave a link at the bottom and we'll work it out from that point on uh other than that uh this is me signing off
So, yeah, if you have any questions about the room, just ask, and I'll get back to you ASA. Cheers.